Lamy Henter. In this video, we're going to be talking about the Sephora Play box per usual. This is, I think, the fourth box that I've received, and I'm so excited. I've been waiting for it for so long. I'm so sorry that a video hasn't been posted in a little bit. I just started school, which kind of sucks. College is rough. Um, it is a lot of work, and I'm tired. But I really wanted to film, I wanted to play with makeup, just have fun, so here I am with the video. The box, and the first thing that we always get is this info, info card with our 50 points that we're going to save. Yes, yes. And then it shows us the products that we get inside. So I'm going to keep that right in front of me. After we have the bag, which is so cute. It has a girl in the front that says 2018 Happy You Year. Oh, so cute. 2018, this is basically to start off our year right. So, I have no makeup on. Let's see what we get in here. Urgh. Oh, God. There's a noodle. So, the first thing that, we, that I pulled out is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer, which is really popular um, now. Look how tiny it is. A raved about product. It is a primer slash moisturizer, I believe. Um, you get to put it on before your makeup, and I'm excited to try that. And after, ah! oh, look at this baby! next we get this Clinique Prep Star Eye Cream, which I've really been wanting eye cream lately. So when I opened the box to just preview what we're gonna get, um, I started laughing because I was like, funny because I wanted eye cream, and here I am, and I have it now. So. We get this little mini eye cream, which I'm excited for. have the Glam Glow Super Cleanse Clearing Cream to Foam Cleanser. So this is a Glam Glow cleanser. I know Glam Glow is really famous for their masks, for like their Super Mud Mask, if you guys have ever heard of it. They're very, very expensive, so had the money to really spend that much. Then next we get a NARS lipstick in the shade Orgasm. So this is the packaging it comes in. I love NARS packaging. It is the most luxe packaging ever. Look at this lipstick. Okay, look at it. It is gorgeous. I opened it and the lipstick just fell out. Oh no. Here's, here's the lipstick. Uh, I'm gonna have to clean this off before I actually use it, but if you do get the box, just be careful with, um, opening it because mine is not properly put in. The, let's see, let's read, L'Occitane Almond Milk Concentrate. This is a velvet soft body cream. Alternate Hair Care Caviar Cream for Hair 10-in-1 Complete Correction. This is a multitasking, moisturizing, and shine-enhancing styling formula for smooth, sleek hair. So the first thing I'm going to try is actually this hair thing. I'm really curious to see how it is. My hair is freshly washed as of yesterday. And this is my hair. It's really long. I'm really excited. I love long hair. I don't really like to have my hair really short. I did at one point, and I regret it. I regret chopping off my hair. So this is the Alterna Hair Care Caviar CC Cream for Hair 10 in 1 cor Complete Correction. Here I am. Oh, so I'm going to grab, it came out like a little, like a lotion consistency. I'm not going to put it at the root of my hair, but more down. And I'm just going to massage it through. And then I'm going to run my fingertips through it as well. My hair is very nappy. Sometimes I don't brush it because it's just so straight. Oh, this smells really, really good. Ooh, really good. Do you guys, do we see the difference, guys? I feel like my hair is so straight that I'll never know how my hair products work, but I'm assuming this hair product won't really mess up my hair, so I like it. I like it, and no complaints, no complaints. Cream. Let's go in with the, the L'Occitane Almond Milk Concentrate. I'm going to put this on my arms and see how it I have, a, I have a shirt on. have a shirt on. I'm going to grab just this much of it. 
I'm going to rub it through my hands and rub it on my arms. It feels really good. Let me grab more, actually. I'm going to grab more just to see how it runs. It's not really thick. It's like medium, I'd say. Ooh, this feels really good. Doesn't smell that bad. It smells sweet. Do any moisturizer is always good. I mean, unless it has like really bad ingredients. But um, L'Occitane is actually very, I heard, I think it's a very expensive brand. So I'm sure that it has very amazing in ingredients in it. Try, I'm, sorry, I'm trying to pull up my shirt so you guys can see that I'm wearing a shirt. Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. I want to be your baby, baby, baby. Nikki Pep Start Eye Cream. And I'm just going to apply, going to open this up. It's so cute, so tiny. So it looks like a little lip balm. Bring some of that out. And I'm going to apply that under my eye. How to use. Using a circular motion, apply a small amount directly under the eye area in the morning or as needed throughout the day. So you can use this throughout the day. It's not only in the morning. That's nice. I'm going to apply this. I love eye creams. I used to use an eye cream a lot. And I feel like it really helps the bags that you have under your eye. Um because it's like supposed to depuff and stuff like that so I really like this it feels really moisturizing like really moisturizing I barely used any making me red it's very very lightweight which is why I think it's a daytime type of eye cream that I love this eye cream feels really really good let's go in with the NARS orgasm lipstick let me clean it off first I should do that because that this is nasty if I don't clean it off. This is a very... It looks shiny. This lipstick is very sheer. Um, I'm trying to swatch it behind my hand, but it's like coming off really, really sheer. Bunch. I feel like I really have to layer it up, but let's see how it works. See, I feel like it doesn't really give you a tint. More like just like a lip gloss effect, but in a lipstick. Does that make sense? Next, we're going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer. And I'm actually really excited to try that because it's moisturizing. And I really love moisturizing primers for the outside of my face. Not I'm just going to pull out a little bit. It looks like lotion, literally. And it's, see, it's very liquidy because it's just seeping down my hand. Ew. It feels very, oh, this feels very lightweight. Oh, this feels good though. Oh, I, I have a feeling I'm really gonna like this primer. Oh, yes. I love, I, I like, I like this so far. I mean, I haven't tried it with makeup and I will try it with makeup in like two seconds. But, I do, I, I, I like it, I like it, I like, I like it, I like it. So guys, I wanted to come back on to say that I tried the Glam Glow, mm, like, cleanser. And I just want to say that it didn't really irritate my skin, um, because it did feel minty, so I didn't, like, put, rub it around my eyes or ever, anything. Um, so I put it, like, all around my face. And I will say that you do need a generous amount of that product for it to like, for me to feel like it actually really, really worked. Um, I do rely on my cleansers a lot to really like take off the residue makeup. Um, one thing I did note was that since I did put lash glue on my forehead, it didn't really take off like the lash glue and the foundation on some of the parts, but um, it's fine. Um, I will say I really did like it. My skin after felt really, 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 really clean. So um, I really did like it. I, I think it's skin sensitive approved. It does feel very minty on your skin. So I was really scared that it was going to irritate it. My skin did get a little bit red. But it didn't really irritate it for like a long time. As you can see, I put on my moisturizer already. And like my skin isn't irritated around my cheek area. So this is how the skin looks like with no makeup on. I so guys, I am doing this vlog style, this outro vlog style, because I just finished filming this makeup look. It is my Rave Girl makeup look. This is um, 
the makeup I did at a rave. I know I look really crazy right now, but I did want to talk about the products that I did use for my Sephora Play Box. Talk about this body lotion. Um, I don't feel it on my body anymore, and it's been a couple hours. So if you like something that makes you feel really, really moisturized all all day, I don't know if this is the one for you, but it works. You know, keeping the body moisturized, especially if you have eczema, you have to keep your body really moisturized all the time. So next, the NARS Lippies, the lipstick. Um, I think this is okay, the Hushbox Primerizer. I really like this. Um, it didn't um, hurt the makeup at all. I used a different primer on my T-zone, so I'm just trying to look in the outer parts of my face. It didn't make my makeup look weird at all, so I like it. I'm going to use it for Playbox. Woohoo! Um, so basically, I liked everything that was in the box. This box was average to me this time. Um, I usually like when there's like a lot of makeup products so I can review those for you guys. Um, but I'm excited to get next month's box. So, I forget to say this every video, but I feel like we should, I should say that I totally recommend getting the Sephora Play Box. I think it's great. They have a lot of brands in their store. So if you love Sephora and going in there, and you're like, oh, I want to try this, this, that. Why don't you just get the Play Box and pay $10 every month to save $10 every month to pay for this? Um, so if you're into this and getting like a little mini sample products to see if any of it works for you, um, instead of buying like the full size and then seeing if it works and then you're like, uh, I didn't like it. Great. Thank you to Sephora, not for sponsoring this video because I don't. I'm a, I'm a little channel, guys. We, we ain't there yet. Giving beginner artists like me a chance to be able to test out makeup like that. Because if I don't have the, all the money in the world to be spending on, like, new collabs or, like, new products. So this is kind of my way of trying out new things without having to buy the whole thing. Um, you guys will see in future videos if I like some of this stuff, I will be reusing it. That's how you know I like something if I keep using it and using it. It's because I really like it. Um, if I don't use it and it's never mentioned, then not really. I like it, but I don't. Um, it's not like my favorite thing in the world, you know? So I just want to say that. I really go, I really hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, girl. You better subscribe or boy, you know? We can do this makeup look together. We can do this all as one. Harmonized beauty. Yes. Oh my god, I'm so weird. So, um... I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll try to get more content up because with school, it's so hard. But please come back for the next one. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Mmm, yes, yummy. I look like a blue cupcake.